I feel crazy. Um, I've decided to film this because I thought it'd be fun to, like, save, you know? Um, I've got a mirror here. I'm in my dorm room. I don't have a roommate. Maybe, maybe this is why. I, unlike Trixie Mattel, I dotted out where I want my eyeliner to go. Trixie, if you want help with symmetry, that might be a skill. <laughs> That's so, that's so backhanded. Oh my god. Anyways, um, I literally hold my breath and I do this. Fuck. I'll just not be symmetrical after I just made that joke about Trixie Mattel. Fuck. That's not symmetrical. <laughs> Kinda looks like me with the lights down. That's about to be me. That's about to be me. <sighs> See, the crazy thing is, is I don't want to like hype myself up too much, but like amongst the the norm cores, I am kind of an eyeliner queen. Like I am. That's kind of my thing. I've been doing it. People are like, oh my god, how are you so good at eyeliner? I've been doing it since I was thirteen. Like, I'm 19. Um, and that's just something about me that I have to, like, live with, you know? Like. Okay, I feel like that has a better arch to it. Now it looks weird. Okay, we're just gonna make sure we do the same thing over here. You know, follow. See, it doesn't help that I feel like I have uneven eyes in general. Trixie, I understand your struggle. I'm sorry for making fun of you. Okay. Yeah, one of those is definitely higher now. Um, you're like, Molly, what inspired this choice? Because this is an inspired choice to have decided to do this. The answer is, is I have an eyeliner to use up. It's the Elf Liquid Liner, which probably isn't recommended for this because of how much space I have to fill. But it's happening. Let me fill this in so that I get some visual, like, understanding of where I'm at. How? I feel like this isn't the same. I mean, see, the thing is, is Trixie would, I feel like Trixie would shame me for not making it symmetrical. But also, she wouldn't make it fucking symmetrical. That's better. We're gonna stick with that for now. I'll be back. It's Trixie Mattel inspired. It don't look like her. It will. I have no like it's it's gonna. I also am really excited to see if she actually comes out with eyeliners. Cause I would really like to get one. I'd really like to get an eyeliner. I would. I just I already told you, I do wear my eyeliner basically every day. I was just telling my friends about this. I I literally feel naked if I don't have eyeliner on sometimes. If I do if I do my makeup, I have to have eyeliner on or else I feel like I look crazy. Um, so that's that. Uh, I feel like I should have brought up another fucking reference pick. Anyways... I don't think she fills this in yet, actually, because she does the eyeshadow. I don't care. We have to use up an eyeliner. This is being done improper. I don't know the last time I put this much fucking eyeliner on my face. Who is this? Who? Who am I? Am I a man? For anyone who's going to be like, Molly, that's not how Trixie Mattel does her makeup. She does not do this in that order. You're crazy. I just... I need... I need... It's how I'm going to do it, okay? I was going to watch a tutorial, but then I realized, no offense, she talks a lot. And, like, I I clearly do, too, but, like, I need, I need the, I need, I need the steps. I just, someone edit one of her videos, so it's just the freaking steps. Sorry. <laughs> I will say, though, e.l.f. liners are crazy, because I've had this one since at least the summer. Like, I don't think I bought a new one before coming to college. Well, like, you know, in that week. Um, 
I think this is from like July when I went on my trip. Turns out, depression. Sorry. Alexa, stop playing. She won't play my freaking playlist. It's kind of annoying. A playlist that I like listening to because it's like the weirdest conglomeration of music. But she won't play it. I mean, is it gonna give Trixie Mattel? Maybe. I feel like I went too high. I feel like I did too much. I feel like I look so silly when I... And my eyes look like this. Hey, all I'm saying is this is going to look more even than when she did Trisha's makeup. Not tr who's Trisha's who I am. Um, I'm Trisha Martell or Trisha Motel. I haven't decided. Um, I'm not a ring light. It's my, t it's my art tablet. And the screen is set to full brightness and a white background so that I have a makeshift ring light. Because I'm thinking of buying one, but I am... Kind of a poor college student, so I don't really want to spend my money on that. I also don't have Trixie lashes. Sorry, girl boss. I just, I can't. So I got these little itty bitty ones. That, mm. If I put them down here, does that... Okay. Okay, I thought I'd show you my inspiration for maybe why it is so rounded, okay? It looks better when my eyebrows are resting. It looks better when my eyebrows are resting. This is It's from my favorite photo shoot of Trixie's. I love this. I love this. I love this shoot. All of her photos. She looks so pretty. <laughs> but that's my inspiration. That's, that's my inspiration. I'm going to do more cool toned browns, I think. I just, I love looking at it. In the tutorial I was watching, she did her eyebrows next, which I feel like is a crazy step, but, whoa. Okay, um, this is my usual pen, like, for, I use for my eyebrows, but I realize it's running out, and I'm kind of trying not to be super upset about it, so I, yeah. I feel like Tracy would just stop here. Sorry, she, her eyebrows look so faint. And, um, granted she's a blonde, so that makes sense. I'm not a blonde, so I will not be doing a blonde's eyebrows. I instead use this Revlon Colorstay Eyeliner. I used it as an eyebrow pencil for years. That's the sad part. Um, and then I got this L'Oreal eyeliner that I used last night as well. Oh, I did this, I did this last night and now I'm doing it again. <laughs> that's, see, that's not getting as dark as I want it to be. But I will admit, I do think the the episode where Trixie did the Priscilla makeup is, I understand why she's not a brunette, but she is so pretty as a brunette. Like that just made, ooh, it made me so happy. Why have I not done drag makeup sooner? I feel like this eyebrow shape works so much better for my face. Um, since the new episode of Drag Race comes out tonight, I am hoping um, my friend is watching it so that I'll be able to text her and be like, hey, um, what do you think of the episode? My mom, who's an ally, I'm a lesbian. My mom is an ally. She's great. She asked me to set up our TV so it would record Drag Race for her, which I think is really nice of her. Um, because then she, we can talk about it together. Also, I think she just likes how mean they are to each other. Um, because now we're, we, she loves watching Untucked. Like, I don't. I personally... I, untucked is untucked. Whatever. I do think it's good. But, like, I kind of hate how the episode's 30 minutes and only 15 to 20 are the actual queens and the other. And the rest of it is, like, whoever the guest judge was being like, oh, my God, guys, it was so great. And I'm like, I don't care. I want to see them fight. Um, I also, I do love Pit Stop. I do, I have to say, I've been binge-watching Pit Stop in my free time. That show is so freaking funny. Bianca, Bob, dude, my entire, like, YouTube is just, like, do you want to watch more Drag Race, but you don't have Paramount? Mm, we got you, boo. We got you, girl pop. And then I go, thank you. Thank you. It's about as good as I'm going to get them right now. I hate that 
freaking I'm gonna have to do like a clean of all my brushes um and then Trixie uses this but I used it first well, I didn't really know who Trixie was when I started using this I think I probably knew who she was but I didn't like know who she was when I started using this this was just my go-to concealer because I liked how full coverage it was um I saw Trixie carving out her brows so I carved out my brows I'm just gonna take from inside the freaking bottle I didn't realize how much of my makeup this is going to use. Mario, my eyebrows coming unstuck. <gasps> okay, to be fair, I didn't actually use glue to stick them. I used a mixture of things. And that's probably why it's doing that. But, no. Ugh. 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 Seriously? Okay. See, the good thing about carving out your brows is you can see the mistakes you made. I can see where I didn't bring this one as far down. Anyways. Um, yesterday I was being a little shithead and I maybe said a few things when I was attempting tricks like before I like took off my makeup for the day I was like oh let me see if I can even do Trixie makeup just like you know shit around and then I tried it and I was saying ugh, it was so easy I regret saying that now because this isn't easy like this is just kind of frustrating like there's just so many steps and it's like, oh my god, I can't imagine doing this surrounded by other people who are talking. Like, in cameras? My god, no, I'd get so fed up so fast. I already don't like on Drag Race when it becomes sappy story hour. I like when drag queens tell stories, but sometimes I just don't care. This is so mean of me to be saying, I'm sorry. Sometimes I am really interested in them. I can't, like, lie. I do think, um, I did enjoy the ones I heard last season. Uh, there haven't been that many. Oh, I like cheering. I can't remember any of the drag queens from this season's names. Except for Dawn. I love Dawn. I love her. She's so cool. Um. I mean, she's, she's giving. I think. I don't know what she does next. She start carving out her face now. I'm gonna do my eyeshadow, actually. I was gonna go to Cool Tones, but I'm just gonna use the e.l.f. palette. It's broken, but look how pretty she is. I love her. Um, Cause I am, I'm trying to recreate that bronze look, the bronzer collection look. I will say this, my um, art school teacher called me out like on a one-on-one, -on -one, not in front of the whole class, for having my own method to do things. Um, which just meant I went on my phone during class. And I am kind of seeing that here. Because I am, like, thinking, well, I should be watching... My friend would ma be making fun of me right now for not watching the tutorial and just going for it. Um, but... I don't know. I feel like I've watched enough of her videos. I've looked at her face so many times that, like, this... This is pretty easy. Like, I don't, I, like, no, e again, easy is the wrong word, because I am not having the easiest time doing this, but I feel like that's the thing where people fuck up. They watch the tutorial, and they follow the tutorial, and I can't follow tutorials, because I get lost, because it's too much, okay? Like, it, you're going too fast for me, and t pausing to do it, and then, oh, it's too much, so I'd rather just watch it like do it on my own time to check the picture oh let me in <sighs> let me in yeah she's so angled she's very she's very angled in a way i am not but we're just gonna kind of smoke that out a little bit more um you know just whatever i mean who's gonna stop us i mean what would happen if you just Call Taylor up. Yeah. It has now come to me that she just kind of wings her little lower pit. Because she does the white afterwards. Fuck. God, I hate her. Grr. Okay. We can do this. So I feel like it is very... It follows the line of that. Why... Drag race starting in like 30 minutes. 
Well, for me starting. I watch the the recording. I don't watch it live. Because I hate watching ads on MTV. Said what I said. I said what I said. Hey Alexa, what time is it? 24 minutes. Okay, that's an assumption. That's what this is. This is an assumption. Might change. Who knows? That burp. Mm. Cheers to that one. I do. I feel like this isn't a look that really comes together until the white eyeliner. Now, the more I do it. Um, instead of my usual bronzer, which you know might sound bad, but to me, I know what I mean. Um, we're gonna go in with Shocker, another e.l.f. product. What is this? Trixie Mattel does a, does a, a look of e.l.f. products? Putty bronzer. This is my go-to bronzer before I switch to the Halo Glow one, which... Frick, why would I go back? I love the Halo Glow one. So good. So nice. Doing this instead of, like, listening to music was such a smarter idea. I lied, I do need the Halo Glow one, because this is a little too light brown. I'm just gonna get this one there. Um, yep. Get it in those spots, I guess. God, the way she just... The way she does anything! God, I freaking... I don't... She's crazy. Like, I respect her and I love her, but... She's crazy. I hate that this is coming together. I hate that I committed to this. Like, I... I was telling my coworkers that I was like... Because one of them knows who Trixie Mattel is. I was like... Yeah, I'm going to do Trixie Mattel makeup. And she's like, oh, really? And I'm like, yep. And so she's like, I expect pictures. <sighs> I was doing the whole, um, what's the, when Trixie was on All Stars during Snatch Game when she did RuPaul? I call, oh, that's, I don't say RuPaul, I say RuPaul. My mom hates it. Um, when she was doing RuPaul, and she was like, winner, winner, chicken, dinner. <laughs> That's my favorite fucking clip, because I just, I don't understand it. Like, it's so awkward for so many reasons. In you know, whatever. Why am I a prettier drag queen? Ugh. Oh. I'm such a pretty drag queen. <laughs> Madonna stuns a new selfie. <laughs> I'm gonna send a picture of this to my mom tonight and she's gonna love it. I hope. I hope. <laughs> she's either gonna love it or she's gonna be like, oh my god. This is gonna be a picture she shows to her coworker I love or she's gonna... <sighs> kind of eats. I gotta say, I love Trixie Mattel's makeup for drag. I do think it is some of the, like, it is one of the most iconic makeup styles, you know? Like, she really pioneered for big eyeliner girls. That could be totally incorrect. I just, I just like her makeup. <laughs> it speaks to me as a fellow Barbie lover. I have a Barbie doll in my room and a Barbie poster and just a Barbie magazine and the Barbie movie script and I, I, I love Barbie. I love Barbie. Um, so she really resonates with me. You know what I do hate about her makeup though? I will. No lies here. I hate ha doing her lips. Only works on her freaking face because I, I did it. <sighs> Ooh. Yeah. What's I gonna do? I don't know. We're going back in with this because we have to carve out. Fuck. Like, am I Trixie Mattel? No, I'm Trisha Martell. Okay, we're between Trixa Mar Trixa, who? Uh, Trisha Martell. 
and Trina Motel. Okay, and I hear that go through there funny. And just off brand enough. We're gonna do some here, you know, to brighten my under eye. That is sickening. Why am I burping so much? This is embarrassing. It's another good thing that I'm doing this the night before a lot of people are supposed to be back on campus. I had to come back early because I did have a job on campus. And um, I'm so glad I'm doing this like the night before a lot of people are back because I have to walk to the bathroom to take this off. I don't have like real makeup remover. Like I have those reusable makeup towels, those micro fiber ones or whatever and those are fine like but I don't ha I have a Berta filter that I can like pour on my freaking face but like I'm gonna have to do a deep shower after this oh my god I'm gonna have to take such a fucking shower after this god damn it <sighs> oh I do want to flex oh wait never mind I couldn't find it anyways I ha yeah I have to walk to my bathroom and uh do my take my makeup off yeah i think this is even more fitting though right now because i'm currently in the great state of wisconsin which if you don't know is trixie's home state um i that's where i go to school and it's pretty cool you know like just I'm not from wisconsin i don't like this state i was telling someone who's from wisconsin how much i hate it here um I think I actually have to film this, you know, doing the nose. I think that goes just a little too far down, but we're going to blend it and be back. Okay, I'm going to call that good. Just kidding. Um, I also don't care about using so much of this because this is the NYX Epic Wear liner. I think NYX discontinued a liner, but I don't think it was this one. I just, I don't like the formula of this liner. So, yeah. We're just gonna go freaking ham, I guess. And I do like that this comes all the way around. Oh, God. Okay, I kind of think I, like, held my breath for most of that. I, I am kind of enjoying how this is turning out. Um... But you may be like, Molly, why are you starting Drag Race in 11 minutes? Um, because it's currently 8.19, doesn't it start at 7 your time? Well, the answer is yes. Um, oh, I already said I don't like watching the commercials. Um, I also like that I can, uh... She just lets that fade, right? Yes, she does. Awesome. I have to fill that entire space now. God damn it. Um, I also like being able to go on Twitter after watching and ha know that everyone's like, you know, and see the discourse. Because I'm not really active in Twitter communities. Never have been. Probably never will be. Um, and I do just like kind of seeing the discourse from afar. Um... That's how I feel right now. That's how I feel. Um, yeah. I don't know. Ooh, are there any hot takes I can put in for this? Um, I don't like Plain Jane. Um, I know of the allegations against her. I remember seeing people talking about that on Twitter. And that kind of made me want to be like, eh, I don't know how I feel about you. And then, um... I just, I, I understand that people are like, oh my god, if you think she's mean, you won't be able to survive the earlier seasons, which just makes you sound like a straight dude talking about a Call of Duty lobby. Sometimes I don't like mean people, okay? Like, I understand being mean in a conf confessional. Like, I do understand that, because, like, obviously they still see it and stuff. It's being so directly mean to people in their face especially at the beginning of the season it doesn't do you any favors than make these people not like you also when you're in a raid a queen system i get that you're doing your whole thing where you're like oh my god yeah i'm just gonna fuck with the system and i'm gonna blah 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 be a bitch but like yeah 
I don't know. I just... I don't care about the Raider Queen thing and how she's doing that. I don't care that she's being overly rude in her confessionals because that's whatever. I just, I'm not a fan of her just being mean to people to their face. So, like, you just met them. Like, I don't know. If, I don't care if it's drag queen culture. It's It, it hurts my heart. <laughs> I'm just, I don't like when people are mean. <laughs> I feel like, oh, I feel like this has turned out good. Can I, like, pull this down? Just. <laughs> Wow. Uh-huh. Yeah. I can hear people in my hallway talking and it's making me terrified to leave this room ever. <laughs> I just, I don't want to deal with people. I don't want people to see me like this. I lived in a cool place like my friend who has a drag queen literally living on their floor. I wouldn't be so afraid. But I'm in rural Wisconsin. <laughs> And I had friends who stopped being my friend because I was gay and they were homophobic. Anyways. That was a rough time for me. I listened to a lot of Night Shift by Lucy Dacus. Dacus. I have a passion for saying people's names incorrectly. Sorry, Io Debris. Yeah, I'm a bad person. I... Uh say things and you're like that could be clipped out of context and I probably wouldn't care <sighs> I mean I don't know what you want from me you want me to make a funny joke I'm just focused on getting this done I don't know if it's the formula of this or what but it makes me feel like I shouldn't be putting it this close to my eyes even though it's a fucking eyeliner like what it feel it also feels like it's tightening the skin of my inner eye. It's like one of those anti aging products. Oh my god, Trixie Mattel, you'd love this then. Old. I looked up her age actually. Um, when I was talk, uh, me and my mom were talking about ages of drag queens, and I was like, oh, how old's Trixie? And I was like, oh my god, she's actually like way younger than I thought she was. Like, I don't know. She's she's younger than Katya, which, like, trips me up sometimes. Because I'm like, oh, wait. It's like one of those, all the friendships I have, except for the one with my friend who I've been talking about this entire episode. Um, where, don't, this will get cleaned up. Trust me. Trust, you will be dealt with. Um, yeah... Um, no, my friend, a lot of my friends are older than me, so I relate to Trixie in that regard, if that's her situation, I actually don't know outside of her and Katya's friendship, who her friends are, I guess she's friends with Brittany Broski, who's younger than her, my friend is a lot like Brittany, in the fact that she just says out-of-pocket shit, and I go, huh? I literally would be sending her clips of Britney's podcast when I was listening to it last semester during my ceramics class because I was bored. Um, and she'd be like, and I'd listen to something she'd say and I'd be like, oh my fucking God. That is probably something my friend has said to me. <sighs> okay. A few things I'm going to do touch-ups on now. Oh my God. I do, I feel a little sad that I don't have like big, big lashes to put on with this. Unless I wanted to make one, some out of fucking paper but i don't even have construction paper i was gonna get a glue stick today for my job because i work in an office and guess the fuck what we don't have glue sticks huh we're literally arts and crafts central we aren't but they think we fucking are they give us like all these they'll find just random stuff around the school and like all these classrooms and they'll be like well in these like dorm rooms and they'll be like oh my god so, we don't know what to do with this, so we're going to give it to you guys. Why? Like, literally, why? Um. <laughs> the marker doesn't like to work for me anymore. It makes me really sad. I've had this for too long. It's it's had its time. She is dead. She, like, she's, she should be retired, but I... 
and I was at the store, and I almost bought one, and then I was like, no, I think I got a little bit longer on it. Well, a little bit longer meant right when I returned to college, because, shit you not, you stopped working. Okay. Now I'm just gonna warm you up. Yeah, I don't know why my under eye feels like this, because I don't think it should be. should not be feeling so painful. Like, ma'am? Oh, I just remembered Trixie doesn't do mascara on her bottom lashes. It wouldn't make sense for her, too, but it makes me sad, because I love mascara on my bottom lashes. <gasps> I can start Drag Race in a minute. Oh, my God. <sighs> okay. Okay, yeah. This white eyeliner sucks. And I'm sorry I used it. I'm sorry, Trixie. Yeah. Okay, it's 8.30. When I come back, I will have um, it all done. Actually, I'll probably stop in between. I can't watch RuPaul on my TV because my Hulu's weird. I have to watch it on my tablet. Oh my god, this is embarrassing for me. Okay, that's whatever. Okay, I thought I'd pop in. Um, loving, loving, loving. Um... Here we are. I I see the vision and I see the finish line and I'm I put a little highlighter on and I I can't wait to get there. All I'm going to say is the producer saw how Jane did her stupid fucking Rita Queen and went, mm, results are being shown. We're going to let these bitches know." Eee! Okay, I can skip through ads. Um yeah. I don't know. My lash, my lash is there. I put it, tried to put it a little higher as if that would help me. I don't think it did. Mm. Hi, I'm Trixie Martell. <gasps> I'm kind of obsessed. I kind of, it was a rocky road, which is my favorite kind of ice cream. So, yeah.